Hey guys, what's up? It's Steven Dillon with Core Therapy and Pilates. I'm the founder of Pilates for PTs. And today I just got an email. It's Super Bowl Sunday and I just got a message from someone today, or it was last night, I think, saying that I had posted something, I had mentioned something in one of my posts about uh, hiring for culture, the right culture, you know, hiring the right person for your culture. And they didn't understand what I meant by that. And then they've gone out and got a job and now it doesn't sound like it worked out so well and they now understand what I meant by that. They were in a bad culture, a place with bad culture. So it, it got me thinking. And then I just read this article about the Super Bowl and I was a little bit shocked by this. And it talked about the recruits, when these guys that are all starting in the Super Bowl, what they were ranked as a high school recruit, either a five-star, a four-star, a three-star, a two-star, or, or not ranked at all. And it was actually kind of interesting because it, it, it made me kind of parallel the two. And, and I'll go over that real quick. Uh, for Kansas City, again, these are their high school rankings when they came out of high school going into college. Now they're starting on the NFL for the Super Bowl, okay? So for Kansas City, they've got five five-star recruits. They've got 13 four-star recruits. They've got 21 three-star recruits. They got six two-star recruits. And they got eight that were not ranked at all by any recruiting services at the time that they went to college. So, kind of interesting. The least number was the five stars. All right, now let's talk about San Francisco. San Francisco has three five stars, nine four stars, 20 three stars, 10 two stars, and 11 that were not ranked. So, there you have it. If you look at those numbers and those statistics, now obviously there's way less five stars than there are four stars or three stars, but and there's less four stars than there are three stars and two stars, etc. But when you look at that, there's there's a handful of five stars that are the like the elite people on the team. They're running a the team. That's the like they're the they're the high end people on the team. They're the people doing a lot. And then you got your four stars and they're really good players on your team and they're doing a lot and they're contributing a lot. And then you got your three stars and those are getting into your more role players. And without those role players, stuff doesn't happen. And your two stars are the people that are like, no one gave them a chance and you've given them a, given them a chance. So they're gonna actually perform like five stars. And then you're not ranked, those guys are in the same boat. They got a chip on their shoulder. No one gave them a chance at all. So that's I, I, I kind of a parallel of the Super Bowl today with company culture and creating a team and having a team where everyone kind of understands their role if that makes sense. So that's what I got for you today. Happy Super Bowl. I, I'm not really interested. I'm not gonna be watching too much because uh, if the Saints were in it, I'd be excited and watching it. But other than that, I'm not too excited. <laughs>